Hello Avid Watchers and welcome back to the channel. In today's news, Ben Shepard updated GMB fans on Kate Garraway's husband Derek Draper's progress as he continues his coronavirus battle. Speaking on Friday morning, the TV host gave fans the latest news from his co-star. A lot of you have been asking how Kate, Dar Darcy and Billy are, and Derek. We can update you because Kate did last night on her Instagram. In her post, Kate detailed how she had FaceTimed her Komoto's husband during the weekly Clap for Carers initiative and gushed that she believed he can hear us. During the video call, Kate beamed as she watched children light smoke-colored flares while talking to her husband, who she believes could hear her. Derek is understood to be in an unresponsive critical condition following seven weeks in intensive care after being admitted to hospital with COVID-19. Kate took to Instagram to share a video of her son Billy, 10, showing a Lego version of his family, with Derek taking center stage on a stand. The following morning, Ben then read out her post saying, So our hashtag NHS clap was our little, a little different tonight. We still clapped and cheered as much as ever, but I couldn't film on my phone, as had Derek on FaceTime throughout. Of course, we can't know, but I believe he can hear us. He's still in a coma, and I thought at least the incredible at NHS teams looking after him, he would hear our gratitude. Love to all in these terrible times. The separation from loved ones, whatever the reason, is so tough. After reading the post, Ben then went on. She's been doing this and a lot of people can share thoughts with their loved ones. The feedback we've had from people in comas has been that they can hear things. Earlier on Thursday, Kate shared a thank you to fans for their ongoing support. The presenter, who has regularly kept followers updated with Derek's progress, told how the mess messages of support have meant the world to her, as her husband fights for his life in hospital. Writing in her latest blog post, Kate said the kind words were comforting as she tries to remain strong for her husband and children, Darcy and William. She said, I wanted to send a huge thank you to all of you who have sent me such wonderful messages wishing Derek well. It has made the world to me. I am sorry I have not been able to reply to them individually, as I am sure you will understand that I'm focusing on my family and Derek right now. The TV host continued, In quieter moments, I am reading all of your messages, and they are so comforting and wonderful to read. Kate is said to be phoning her husband, with whom she ra raises children Darcy and William on a daily basis, while he remains on a ventilator in intensive care. Talking to COVID-19 survivor Julie Stanfield, her daughter Gabrielle and the NHS staff who saved her life on Wednesday's edition of GMB, Ben admitted his co-host had found a degree of reassurance in calling Derek. He said, One of our colleagues, Kate Garraway, has said that one of the things that has been really comforting for her is the fact that the staff are taking her phone call in the evenings and she can talk to her husband. She has no idea if she, he's responding, but it clearly gives her a sense of comfort and there is hope that there it is. Last Thursday, Kate updated her supporters to reveal Derek was still with us and fighting so hard to beat coronavirus. And the following day, Kate was given hope while her husband battles on in hospital by fans sharing their stories of recovery from COVID-19 after weeks in ICU. The GMB presenter thanked a fan for telling her about her own husband's survival of the virus following a seven-week stint in intensive care. Derek is best known for his career as a former lobbyist. During his time as political advisor, he was embroiled in two political scandals, 1998's Lobbygate and in 2009 a scandal surrounding Labour List, the website he edited. He went on to write two books, Blaze 100 Days and Life Support, before retraining as a psychotherapist. Kate and Derek have been married for 14 years, with the former lobbyist cheering his wife on from the duration of the stint on I'm a Celebrity last year, he flew out to Australia with their two children to meet her. The couple who wed in September 2005 have previously discussed the union, with Derek admitting that he feared she was a high-maintenance TV bimbo. Following her stint on I'm a Celebrity, the couple were planning to renew their vows in the coming months. That's all for today's news. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next video.